What up, what up, what up? What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy, Jesse. Welcome back to another Meta 25 Online Rank Match. And today, we are going up against the San Francisco 49ers. And we decide to go with the Oakland Raiders. Now, another uh, game up on the PS4. And um, definitely, uh, you know, enjoying just uh starting over again and trying to climb now people are asking me in the live stream am i gonna stop playing xbox one absolutely not am i going to uh <coughs> you know just only do ps4 no you know i'll be switching between uh both consoles and whatnot actually i believe i'm a live stream today you know xbox one i think i'm gonna go on ahead and do um the cardinals franchise during the live stream and play some subs and stuff like that like always man so, uh, going up against the 49ers, man, you already know how well they stopped the run. So, uh, got to be careful. You know, DMC is a glitch, but so are the 49ers defense. So, you got to be careful, man. They hit the, um, they hit very well. But, like I said, look at my main man, DMC, just like that. Dude is a glitch, man. Great speed, good power, good agility. Uh, if you guys, uh, don't know, there was a Madden update. I haven't tested it out yet because I haven't played since the update happened yet. But, uh, you know, what I've been hearing is that there's a huge Madden update. They took out the stiff arm glitch, as people call it. I uh, believe that is no more. And I also heard that they nerfed the back juke. I don't know if they got rid of it altogether or it's just like damn near doesn't work. Obviously, the back juke um, was very, very effective during kickoff returns. And um, it is something that became... Uh, very big in the community um so you know something that if you time it right the defenders they just all come downward like towards the middle giving you outside space so i don't know you know um i'm definitely gonna find out today when i live stream but uh i heard that the stiff arm is no more which i mean it's good and it's bad you know it's good for the fact that uh it is a headache to deal with i mean it is something that you can't stop but it is a headache to deal with you know it is something that's very frustrating if somebody just continuously keeps doing it on you and uh it will frustrate the heck out of you but then again it sucks because what do you give the power runners now you know what i mean like uh if you got somebody like a brandon jacobs or an eddie lacy or somebody like that those big slow backs what do they have you know i hope that they made trucking you know more uh, applicable, <laughs> you know, because trucking is damn near non-existing, so if you got a running back like that, you can't stiff arm, how is it that you get through defenders now, they're slow, so you're not going to outrun people, not like a Reggie Bush or Jamal Charles with those guys, where we all know speed has been very dominant in Madden forever, you know, this is one of the few, uh, few Maddens I can remember where I would have preferred somebody like a Marshawn Lynch over a Reggie Bush, you know, because that stiff arm is deadly, you know what I mean, uh, you get to the outside, you can just wreak havoc with it. Now, it's like, what are you going to do now? Especially on next-gen consoles where you can't really truck. It's like, how are you supposed to get by people? You know, uh, elusiveness really isn't their thing. Yeah, you could probably juke somebody, but it's not like a Reggie Bush or, you know, um, LaShawn McCoy where they could juke four people in one in one move. You know, uh, Marshawn Lynch isn't capable of doing that, you know. So, uh, it's going to shake things up a little bit. You know, now it's back to being more of a... But speaking again, I haven't tried it yet. I haven't um, really worked on the update. But like I said, I have been told that they did get rid of it. And um, it's, it's, uh, it's, it's, I think it's going to level some things out, you know, in the game of Madden. Because we all know a lot of people hated it. They hated it. <laughs> a lot of people disliked it. So now that it's removed from the I don't know what took them so long to remove it in the first place. Like a, if, um, if it was such this overpowered thing. Right there, don't. Test user. He is so disrespectful. Somebody, please give that gentleman a little bit. Do not throw the ball my way. I'm snagging these screens, man. Um, one thing during the live stream, somebody told me, was like, yo, you made me and Butler, the person that you love so much in your Cardinals franchise, is actually on the Raiders. And I'm like, word? I got to go on ahead and put my main man Butler in. And right there, you see me trying to force feed Butler. I'm trying to give him the ball, man. It's my boy Butler, baby. So, um... They did remove, like I said, the stiff arm from the game. So, as far as I've been told, you know, I haven't experienced it yet. But, you know, I heard from very reliable sources that it's gone. So, um, I, I think that's, you know, crazy. You, you got rid of a move that 
uh, only a few can do. You know, uh, there are plenty of teams in the game where you don't have a running back on the roster that can do it. You know, you need to have a stiff arm of like 87 or better. You know, you need to have pretty good strength in order to do it multiple times. You know, so uh, there's not too many people in the game that can really do it. So to take that away from people, it's 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 gonna it's gonna be um it's gonna be fun to see uh, what people are gonna do now. Um, as right there, we got another user pick. What people are gonna do now? Because I've gone up against people, and uh, you know they heavily you know relied on it. Like me, I've I've been able to win with it. I've been able to win without it. Doesn't really make that much of a difference to me. Yeah, it is uh, a big factor when you know how to do it. But like I said, I know how to win without it, um, which I'm sure uh, a lot of people rely heavily on it you know what i mean so uh it's 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 gonna be fun just to see uh how the community is now uh i wonder how it's gonna do like tournaments and things like that you know uh because a lot of people uh, i'm sure relied on it heavily in tournaments you know m most of the teams you're gonna see are the seahawks and the 49ers and obviously they have frank gore they have marshall lynch and they're capable of doing it so to take that away you know it's, it's gonna bring a different dimension you know and it's actually good to see uh ea there goes my main man uh butler look at butler get loose into the end zone though it is good to see that ea is is making patches you know when was the last time you saw ea really making patches in order to fix things you know what i mean so i really believe they're they're actually listening to the community um they're actually trying to improve the game and you know i i applaud them for doing so you know what i mean because uh there really hasn't been besides roster updates Madden has been a game where you could go the entire Madden year without a, a, a patch, you know. So for them to patch it, I think, is, is a big move for the community. You know, that just lets us know that they're willing and wanting to go on ahead and make changes to, uh, you know, a better, uh, you know, suit the game. So I, I definitely am, am very happy to know that when I found out that they patched it, I thought it was awesome. I was like, that's great. You know, they're actually patching stuff that I'm sure people were complaining about. You know that and the back juke. Uh, maybe I, I don't know where they got this info from. Maybe maybe they watching me, y'all. Maybe they watching me. They're, whoa, whoa, whoa! This back juke, this stiff arm has got to go. <laughs> so um, I, I just think it's it's gonna be uh, crazy to see how it is. You know what I mean? Like I said, I haven't played with it yet, so of course I'm gonna try. Obviously, you know uh, I'm gonna see if I can go on ahead and get that stiffy. But just to know that it's gone, it's uh, it's I, I really applaud EA. Like I said, man, for making the patch. So. You know, going into this game, man, we are up 24 to 7. We've been doing pretty well, uh, being able to move the ball offensively, defensively, we forced a couple of mistakes. Now, this guy was killing me with his, uh, I believe, uh, was it under center or shotgun? I'm not sure. But he was coming out in snugs. I think that's it right there, under center snugs. Just killing me, single back snugs. And he was killing me with it, man. Quick little routes. You know, um, he would have Vernon Davis on like a streak or a corner route. And he was just mixing mixing up this combination of routes that was heavily, heavily, heavily frustrating me. So uh, he was having a lot of success with it. Uh, when we got him away from it, then we started to do a little bit better. But there he is again with the single back snugs. And uh, he was just giving me issues with it right here. He does a nice call, calls the toss, scores a touchdown. So uh, he still has an opportunity. You know what I mean? It'll be stupid for me to go on ahead and say this game is over. He has all of his timeouts. Two-minute warning still hasn't even approached yet. Plenty of time. The fourth quarter just started. So uh, we have a long, long, long way to go. So uh, here we go, man. We roll out right here. I tried a wide receiver screen, but I went absolutely nowhere. I reroute him. I had room to run, but I seen that the streak was going to be open. I throw it, and I get no type of uh, awareness from Butler, man. That right there is no bueno. Uh, right here, man. Let's see if we can go ahead and pick up this first down. This will be big. We're standing in the pocket. We're looking. We roll out. Let's see if we can find somebody else. And we do, but he drops the ball, so we're forced to go on ahead and punt the ball, give him the ball back. And if he scores here, man, um, I don't know. I don't know. I, I just may be in trouble. You know what I mean? Uh, going up against the 49ers defense, anything can happen. You know, so being in a situation where uh, he's one score, he's one possession down from taking the lead or tying the game, it's like, you know, you'd be a little bit worried because you never know what hit stick may happen. Uh Block shed sack like these Niners play too serious, man. But right there, another interception is Colin Kaepernick is finding open Raiders just as much as he is his own teammates. And that right there, he ends up quitting. So that's the end of the game, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. 
As you guys already know, man, I love each and every single one of you guys, man. If you guys have not already, please check out the live stream. Link is in the description. We live stream every single day. So you guys get to watch these games live, man. So go ahead and hit that follow button so you guys know. You guys get an email letting you know when I'm live and I'm playing subs and I'm playing these games. So it's your boy GS. We are out. Peace. Give it to me, baby.